Hello everyone, my name is Katherine Baz and thanks first to Carolyn Levitt for inviting me to be on her blog. Um, I've just finished her wonderful novel, With or Without You, so it's a real pleasure and honor to be here with you. Um, most of my short stories and essays and novels have been about my heritage as a Portuguese American. My father came here from the Azores. My latest book is Our Lady of the Artichokes. It was given a lovely shout out in the New York Times by the book column by my dear friend Tyari Jones. So here's a shout out back to Tyari, um, whose American marriage has done so, so well and such a beautiful book. Um, so there's that. The, the title story was based on my great aunt, who was also from the Azores, complaining one day about getting evicted from her apartment in California due to a uh, condo conversion. And she decided to paint the Virgin Mary on the wall outside and claim it was a miracle. She didn't do it, but I thought it would make a great story. So uh, this collection has been out for a little while. And my most recent project is a fun foray for me into the world of eBooks and video poems and interactive internet uh, publication. The publisher is Catherine McNamara of Artist Proof Editions, which is a wonderful website. You can uh, go on and see the book. This is a, a print edition of it with beautiful artwork with my collaborator, um, Isabel Pavon, who was herself a native of Portugal and a longtime resident of New York. It's a book that has to deal with colors and loss and being female and older and marriage and all sorts of things. It's not as grim as I'm making it sound, I hope. Um, so Artist Proof Editions, uh, The Heart is a Drowning Object is my latest um, experiment. I want to feel that writing can go into different avenues, different modes, incorporate artwork as well. So, so thanks, Carolyn, for inviting me to talk about that. A shout out to some wonderful books that mean a lot to me that I've read fairly recently. Alexander Chi's wonderful um, How to Write a, an Autobiographical Novel. He's got an essay in here called My Rosary, or The Rosary, which is one of my really all-time favorite essays. And another shout out to dear friend Mazu Mingesti, who's just got long listed for The Shadow King um, for the Booker Prize. It's about her native Ethiopia confronting the invasion by Mussolini, and it's about women warriors. So absolutely wonderful novel. Another shout out to an indie bookstore I love, uh, Point Reyes Books in Point Reyes Station, California, which is north of Marin. Um, run by Stephen Sparks and Molly Parent. And what all these people have in common is that we have all met and uh, nurtured our friendship in Lisbon, Portugal, where there's a wonderful literary conference every summer called the Disquiet International Literary Conference. I run the workshop for people of Portuguese Brazilian descent, um, but all sorts of writers of all ages, all types, um, all levels can come there and take all sorts of, of workshops. So we've had a wonderful time uh, introducing also Portuguese authors and Portuguese literature to American audiences as, as well. So um, those are some of the things about me and some of my friends. So thanks very much for listening and um, see you later. Happy reading.